So hello everybody and welcome to another episode of the Risk Online channel. Now I'd like to talk about ColorFX Pro plugin in camera roll and how you can get the best post-production result into your scene. Enjoy! So I'm on Photoshop and every time for browsing through my projects and files I'm using Adobe Bridge but about uh, the bridge I'm gonna talk in another episode more in detail and just for now I'd like to choose a couple of work files and you see on the right side there is some additional information about the files and a simple preview by just by pressing the enter or double click your files are jumping into the Photoshop immediately and now I have a workflow with all my layers down below and the precision of uh, making some exterior image on a project I am working on now and you see uh, for a quick preview made just to show you what appears at the end after all adjustments and color correction etc but now I would like to show you the Nick collection and color FX Pro how does it work and how I'm using it actually that plugin allows me to have a nice and quick adjustment of my image and you see there's a lot of presets they got on the plugin inside you can use just by selecting randomly one of them and which best fit to your scene some correction on the right side and comparison both you can use the option brushing or direct applying above your layers and that's it now because I choose the option brushing I start immediately to work on the mask as you see on the right of your screen and just uh, brush a little bit over in the way and places where I would like to see my changes you can also play with the levels and some modification adjustment as a normal layer and to fit it in the best way you would like to see one more time you can work further with the raw camera effects to get more clarity and details on your image and once when we have installed your color effects plugin it will appear on the filters and down below are the options some more camera roll effects which I would like to talk in another episode more in detail but just for now I just show you how I can use both the color effects pro and camera roll settings to have extremely quick result on my image adjustment and correction and to get really really easy and quick final result on my post production this these are actually lots of options on your camera adjustment settings as you see curve effects highlights saturation is integrated also in needs and the power of camera roll is uh, actually this that you can work with your saturation more powerful using camera roll instead the normal adjustment here you can pick just a point you see the nail 
show is showing you in which area you can bring the correction in the desirable way you would like to have as a final result and more and more effects and noise reduction and these are actually much more settings than the normal adjustments that you have on the right bottom side on your level panel layer panel and also you can select the mode of your camera by using camera but these are much more additional things we not gonna talk now and again using color effects pro allows you to have the quickest post-production final result sometimes i'm using black and white adjustment just to bring some of the colors much more highlighter as you see what i'm doing right now and putting in the luminosity models you see what is changing now and you can brush over on the mask until you get the best results so thanks for watching